Hey, I'm Haitian Barbie K and this is Haitian Barbie TV. Today's topic is forgiveness. What does forgiveness mean to you? So, right now we're going to go to our mail because I have a lot of mail on this topic and I chose two. So, I'm going to just read that off and you tell me what it is. Okay? Hope you're having a good Friday. Okay, so from Dina Moore, forgiving means you let go, you let bygones be bygones after getting even. <laughs> LOL. And from Steve Gardner, he says forgiveness is when you keep the past in the past by understanding we are all human. Okay, and that right there is two different views from two different people one topic so you know what we're gonna do right we're gonna go to our trusty barbie bible you already know you already know and we're gonna see what the word has for us today okay so we see ephesians 4 32 and be ye kind one to another tender-hearted Forgiving one another, even as God for sake, God for Christ's sake, has forgiven you. Has forgiven you. Okay, so you got to remember, we forgive because God has forgiven us. So why do we feel that we have more power where we have to keep a grudge? We can't forgive a person like, oh, God forgave you. I ain't forgive you. Come on, let it go. It's not your battle. Let it go. You're going to be the one looking older than you're supposed to because you got bags in your eyes because you stressed from something that the other person don't even know that they did. They probably don't even have any knowledge of it. You didn't even let them know. You just cut them off. I'm not forgiving that person. No, they did this. Yo, wake up. You're the only one. You got to live for yourself. That stress is only bothering you, no one else. And plus, it makes it awkward for everybody else around you who got to be in the same place where you and the other person that you ain't forgive because y'all having a function or something and your face is screwed up and you can't enjoy yourself because you you don't want the other person to enjoy themselves so you want to keep screwing them please the best revenge for somebody doing you wrong is not not forgiving them it's for forgiving them and moving on being happy showing that you have moved on you good with yourself you got God on your side you don't need anything else. Okay, so just because you offer forgiveness to someone doesn't mean you give them a continued pass. Like, yeah, you can keep wronging me. No. You can either forgive and forget or you forgive and you move on. You keep some distance. If they really care, it'll come back. They'll say they're sorry. They'll stop doing what they do. But you got to show some tough love. But forgiveness is only, it's like basically for you. To keep that awkward place out of your um your circle, okay. So remember, forgiveness is for you and the people you meet in the future. It saves them from encountering all that baggage that you're carrying from the last relationship, from you being raped. You know what I'm saying? Let somebody in to love you. Let everybody have the same chance as somebody else did. So what? Somebody messed it up for for himself. He didn't mess it up for everybody else. You're going to keep putting yourself down and not living because of somebody having power over you. Take your power back. Forgive them. Move on. Forgive yourself for not forgiving them. So you can move on. Okay. Um, before I end this, I would like to. I would like for you to answer this. Have you really forgiven someone who wronged you? Remember, forgiveness is not a, it's not a spoken word. It's an action word. So we don't. We don't say it. We do it. We have to forgive. We have to do it. It's something that you do. Not something that you sit back and say, yeah, I did it. You didn't do it. Because when you see that person, you're still looking at them like, better not say nothing to me. Because you know what I do. No. Leave it to God. Stop fighting battles that ain't got nothing to do with you. If you don't know better, you don't do better. So forgive them. They know, they for not know what they do. You know, so, um, 
Until next time, stay blessed and bar be beautiful. All right, so leave your comments in the leave your comments in the um comment area, please. People, speak to me. I got some of my viewers, you know, giving me some valuable words and stuff like that. But we, I need you to comment on what I'm talking about. Let me know if I'm hitting it right. If I'm Diving deep into it if I'm leaving some out, let me know. And this is your Sunday before Sunday. Out. Bye. Hey, we love you. And so all my Bobby's out there, you know Pink Friday is in the way. <laughs> I'm just saying, you know what I'm saying. It's not all about plastic. It's all about beauty. Keep yourself up. Bye, and all my kins, stay handsome.